mixed messages and we're against each other. Happy to call Are there any students from any questions from the floor, inshallah? Um, Shaykhana, with Nisbati, um, with regard to some of the du'at, um, you may have touched on this slightly, but a bit more specific. What do you think of the stance of being a da'i or not taking a position? For example, what is your aqidah? I'm not telling you. <laughs> what is your aqidah? I'm not going to tell you. What benefit is that for you? What do you think about this position and what is your advice to the du'a? The <laughs> Muslim has a lot of characteristics. They said to the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, one man said, Ya Rasulullah, qul li fil Islam. Tell me something that no one else can say. He said, qul amantu billahi thumma stabim. Say, I believe in Allah, then be upright. So once Prophet Muhammad said he believed, he walked the walk, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Everybody else, we say, a lot of what we don't do. And that's a bad character, quality. Like the Rasul of the Quran said, Ma uridu an ukhalifakum ilama and haqman. I don't want to tell you don't do this and I do it myself. Ya ayyun ladina amin, lima tukhuru, ma la tukhuru. Why do you say what you don't say, what you don't do? It's a bad thing. So one of the characteristics of Islam and the Muslim is, Clarity, man. You have to be clear. You can't be with that low wind, changing colors to please people. How do we know that? Too many proofs of that. Allah mentioned in the Quran, "Yahlika min halaka and bayina tan, wa yahya min hayya and bayina." The yah, walakin yahdi Allahu amra kana mafula. The yahlika min halaka and bayina tan. So that Allah is going to make an affair come into existence and manifest it, He's going to do that. So that the one who's destroyed will be destroyed with clarity. No doubt why He was destroyed. It's clear. And the one who was saved and successful, He'll be saved and successful in clarity. Allah described the prophets and the messages of the religion that He sent to him. لِكُلِّمْ جَعَلْنَا مِنْكُمْ شِرْعَةً وَمِنْ آجَى That's what Allah said. We sent every Nabi and Rasul a Sharia, legislation, halal, haram, eat this, don't eat that way, so on, and a minhaj. What's a minhaj? A tariqa wadiha. The clear path that he's traveling. No ambiguity. Prophet told his companions in his Ummah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, inni taraktukum ala al-muhajjit al-bayba, layruha kalla'ariha, la yazigu anha ila alik. I left you people on a religion and muhajjit al bayba. It's nighttime, it's like it's day, it's clear. There's no ambiguity in the religion of Al Islam. So the Muslim is a person who is supposed to be upright and clear. So, on the other hand, the one who's playing games, he changes colors like a chameleon to fit into the environment. And this is something that is plain worthy. This is the action of the Ifaq, the people of uh, hypocrisy, and the people of the Zayf. May Allah help us. And clarity, Akhwani, doesn't mean being rough and tough and nasty. Clarity doesn't mean talk to people in a condescending way. Clarity is when you give a lecture somewhere, a khutbah somewhere, people know what you're talking about. They know exactly where you're coming from. They don't get you mixed up and you're calling your dawah. They don't get it mixed up with other calls and other dawah. It's very clear what you're saying. And sometimes you don't even have to use some of the buzzwords. Like Ahl Sunnah said, if you don't even have to use those words, the people know. Said if you're not said if. But we're living in a time where the situation requires a lot of, um, a lot of um, wisdom, though, and perseverance. Because we have the opposite of that hadith. Bashiru uh, wa la Give glad times and don't run people away. We run a lot of people away unnecessarily. But there's still people who, inshallah, Allah's given them to appeal. And clarity is part of what everyone needs. Wallahu <laughs> alayhi